very good morning to all the students of class plus to see uh, yes beta new chapter to be started today uh, on the face of it okay uh, before i start the chapter i would like to share screen uh, is it visible to you all please tell me do you see an image on the screen Okay, Sukhman Jot, please uh, unmute yourself and tell me what does this suggest to you? By seeing this picture, what comes to your mind? Handicap people, I can see. You can see handicap people. And can you see normal people also, like those who do not have any disability? Yes, ma'am. Any anything coming to your mind right now, Sukhman, by seeing this picture? Any idea, anything? They all are together. Yes. What else? Very good. They all are together. Do you think the people with disability, they are happy or they are sad in this picture? What do you think? No, I guess they're happy they're talking to other people also. They are happy and they're having good time, according to you. Rana yes, Kuchi, please you tell me. Okay, you can mute yourself, Sukman. Yes, ma'am. Uh, what, what do you think about this picture, Rana? You tell me. That the people that are uh, without disabilities are... Or with the people that are having disabilities and giving them confidence. Yes, very good, very good, very good, Rana Kuchi. Anybody else would like to add something into it? Mehek, you never unmute yourself. At least try to participate. See, students, those who uh, understand, we got so many things. Uh, like Sukhman is saying, by seeing this picture, those who have joined now, for them, I'm repeating, please pay attention. So Sukhman Jod is saying that she says that there are people with disability and they are people uh, who are like, do not have any disability and they are together and they seem to be happy together. According to Rana Gurjeet, uh, that children, uh, sorry, people with, the, you can say, uh, are boosting up the confidence level of the people with disability. So absolutely right perception. Fine, so in this picture, we can see one idea that in one or the other way, we all are same, fine? Though there are people who do not have, you can say, foot, one blind lady can be seen in this, and the person who could not walk, and, you know, and there are people who are supporting them, who are always there with them, and there doesn't seem to be any, you know, hesitation or lack of confidence or mental agony in this picture, Fine. So everyone seems to be satisfied, according to me, in this picture. Fine. So on the one or the other way, all are happy. Do you agree with me, you all? Do you agree? Okay. Devilin, will you participate in this? Uh, I would just like to ask you to participate once at least. You just read what is written on the board. Just quote. Devilin, just read the quotation of the board. I want maximum student participation. Do not hesitate. I'm not going to ask you any question. Whatever is written on this board, this quotation, that I'm asking. Are you listening? So those who are not responding, I'm not going to mark them present. Make sure. Firmat kena hamari absent ki itni zada absent lag chuki hai. Those who do not respond, I will never mark them present. Make sure. Okay, let me ask Vanshika. Read the quotes written on the board. Let's be happy by choice and not by cho chance. Yes, very good. Fine, this is it. Like you are participating. That's enough for me that you are listening to it. Now, let me 
introduce this chapter to you. In the beginning, I show you, uh, I sh like I showed you one picture in which people with disability and people who do not have any disability were standing together, fine, happily. So this chapter is actually going to shed light. It is, I guess, quite clear to you. That's why I showed you. And the quote says, let's be happy by choice and not by chance. That quote is also apt to this chapter. So let me introduce the characters of this chapter on the face of it. Derek, a teenage boy. And we also, we will also be calling him Derry. His nickname is D-E-R-R-Y, Derry. So he's a teenage boy. You know that teenagers are very full of apprehensions. They are so scared of the society when people comment upon them on, you know, sometimes we have, during the teenage, we have eruptions of, you can say, face where these uh, pimples are there, uh, scars can be there, or any differences of the, your voice changes, your appearance change. Sometimes you are fat, sometimes you have a complexion problem. A lot of things are there. And teenagers, they are the most affected, you can say, people, the strata of various age groups, because a lot of changes are going on. Fine. And uh, we will be reading about Derek, who has, you know, half burnt face. So we had, I witnessed an accident and I said, maybe, I'll be telling you in detail. I'm not going to disclose everything here. I'm just telling you, he's uh, having that half burnt face and people, you know, comment about his face wherever he goes. He's at the center of attraction. You know, if this is in the society we are living in. Disability is not with a person. Disability is here in the minds of us. When we make other realize that you are having some problem, you know, this is the habit of our society. They will not look at the 99 good things about you. They will point out the one bad thing about you and that hurts the person the most. So Derek is affected by that thing. He's being uh, the target by so many people about his burnt face and that's why he has become, you know, for you calling someone name is easy, but that person gets affected for whole life. That boy has lost his confidence. He, he has become so negative in his life. He doesn't like to talk to anyone. And you know, hum kya karte? Hum judge karte logo ko. we keep on judging, okay, ye aisa hai, ye hai. you know, why that person is rude. You know, I don't want to talk to that person, but we never try to find out the reason why that person is behaving like that. There might be something. That's why that person behaves like that. Okay, so Derek is very rude, you can say, and rebel kind of personality. Then we say that rebel personality, okay? So he's very defiant in nature, very defiant. So that is the problem with this boy. This, he's the protagonist. Another protagonist is Mr. Lamb. Now, Mr. Lamb, an old and experienced man, I, I'm, I'm telling you, I'm not going to exclude, you can say, expose the whole story here. But let me tell you something about Mr. Lamb. He's just, you know, opposite to what Derek is. He finds Derek quite rude. And Mr. Lamb is sitting in one of his, uh, you can say he's sitting in his garden. And Derek, you know, thinks that nobody is there in the garden. He jumps from the wall and he enters the garden. You know, many boys would enter into the garden and sneak into the garden to just pick apples and you can say some fruit from there, uh, steal the leaf. So he thought, but when he enters and Mr. Lamb notices him, then the conversation between the two starts. Mr. Lamb, an experienced old man, Derek, the teenage boy. Now that conversation st uh, starts and how that conversation changes the life of Derek. That is to be read in this chapter. You know, we, we meet many strangers in our lives. Uh, sometimes they are going to affect your life positively and sometimes they're going to affect your life negatively also. So Mr. Lamb will be positive or negative, we will read. Then we have Derek's mother whose, whose role is not that much in this chapter, but yes, secondary role she's performing, fine. Then, uh, talking about the theme of this chapter, appearances are deceptive. Means, what do you mean by on the face of it? It is written by Susan Hill. Uh, she's a light writer of fiction themes only. On the face of it means, you might have heard about the, in the maths, you might have read like face value and place value. You know, the face value is different and the place value is different. Similarly, uh, you know, when we start judging the person, okay, this person seems to be like this and all, we start judging by looking at the face and appearances. Fine, but when we really get to know that person, 
and then we think okay i was so wrong about that person he's not like that she's not like that fine by seeing the appearance of the person you cannot judge that person clear they are totally uh, you can say can be different also so appearances are deceptive deceptive means it's a cheat you cannot judge a person by looking at his appearance just the way because the, he doesn't look nice it doesn't mean he doesn't have nice personality fine so on the face of it is on the face of it 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 appeals to be something else but the reality can be something else face value kuch aur hai place value kuch aur hai fine by looking at the face we cannot judge anyone fine the outer appearance can be something else and the inner inward personality can be totally different fine that is the meaning of this chapter also people with physical disability suffer in this society so this is also another theme that how they suffer disability does not make them suffer इससे ज्यादा डिसेबिलिटी से ज्यादा तो हम लोग उनको टॉर्चर कर देते हैं वी पीपल अवर मेंटेलिटी वी आर अ वेरी मीन इन थॉट वी सी अ पर्सन विद डिसेबिलिटी एनी डिसेबिलिटी इट कैन बी एनी फेशियल डिसेबिलिटी और हैंड लेग और एनी सॉर्ट ऑफ वी स्टार्ट यू नो सेग्रीगेटिंग दैट पर्सन फ्रॉम अस हम अपने आप को बहुत समझते हैं कि हम पता नहीं क्या है गॉड हैज गिवन यू ऑल हैंड्स फुट in tact we should be thankful for what the, what we have but we sh- at the same time we should be so sensitive towards these people also there are many organizations who are trying to imbibe such values but still you know pehle hum inko kehte the like uh, the that term we would uh, we used like handicaps disable fine disabilities disable ka matlab kya hota hai able in any but now we call them differently able the term has been changed by the society okay we never call them they are disable disable ka meaning hai kuch kar hi nahi sakte i have seen many people who do not who do not have legs and hands but even then they are working then better than the others jo beggar baithe hote hain idhar udhar ya mang rahe hote hain haath pair pure theek hai even then they are begging rather than working fine so uh, like they are differently able they are not disable disable okay they are differently able people so the need of dire optimism for such people this is also one of the prominent themes that aise logo ko bahut zyada they do not need your sympathy they need your empathy that if you put yourself in the shoes of that person ki agar mere sath aisa ho to so then then think accordingly okay so need of dire optimism for such people you can be ray of hope for such people fine so this is one of the prominent themes okay let's start reading the chapter uh, everyone please tell me is it clear to you clear hai sabko yes so those who have joined later beta please be punctual enough so we are going to start this chapter can you see the screen beta screen dikh rahi hai sabko because sometimes it on the face of it is it visible on mol vanshika amarpreet ansh okay fine so let's uh, read the chapter on the face of it by susan hill before you read this is a play okay what is a play in which characters are there in which uh, dialogue exchange is there which can be performed on the stage fine so this is one story in which characters will be speaking the dialogues okay so that's why it makes it a play this is a play featuring an old man and a small boy meeting in the farmer's garden farmer me a uh, old man jis ki baat pehle ki gayi hai okay so old man is sitting in his own garden and a boy a small boy he enters the garden and the old man strikes up a friendship with a boy who is very withdrawn and deaf in underline the uh, characteristics of this boy he is very deafient and withdrawn withdrawn means who does not participate much in activities of society deafient again means he is rebel r e b e l against everything if you say something he just thinks opposite to it so what is the bond that unites the two what is the relation opposite age hai dono ki and how they get connected that we will be reading in this story so very interesting chapter Mr Lamb's garden so this is the scene there is the occasional sound of bird song and of tree leaves rustling dairy's footsteps are heard as he walks slowly and tentatively through the long grass 
he pauses then walks on again he comes around a screen of bushes so that when mr lamp speaks to him he is close at hand and derry is startled startled means shocked heran ho jana surprised so this is the scene mr lamp's garden is there and you know you can just hear the sound of leaves rustling and the bird song and slowly and steadily derry's footsteps are heard and he's walking still the levi is walking slowly धीरे धीरे लॉन्ग ग्रास में से निकल रहा है बिकॉज ही हैज एंटर्ड द गार्डन विदाउट द कंसेंट ऑफ द ऑनर मिस्टर लैम तो वो चुपके से एंटर कर रहा है गार्डन में ही पॉजेज एंड देन ही वॉक्स ऑन अगेन जैसे वो बुशेस के पास पहुंचता है मिस्टर लैम स्पीच टू हिम मिस्टर लैम इज नोइंग दैट ही इज एंटरिंग द गार्डन एंड डेर इज सो शॉक्ड मिस्टर लैम माइंड द एपल्स यू नो इन अ वेरी फनी वे ही स्टार्ट द कन्वर्सेशन कि ध्यान से आगे एप्पल्स हैं एंड ऑब्वियसली दैट बॉय हैज कम देयर फॉर एप्पल्स ओनली फाइन सो दिस इज अ फनी कन्वर्सेशन ही स्टार्ट्स माइंड द एप्पल्स व्हाट हु इज दैट हु इज देयर लैंब इज माय नेम माइंड द एप्पल्स क्रैब एप्पल्स दोस आर सो डेरी वाज अबाउट टू पिक दोस एप्पल्स ओनली वो चोरी करने ही आया था वहां पे एंड ही सेस क्रैब एप्पल्स दोस आर यू नो सॉर क्रैब मीन सार एस ओ यू आर मतलब वो तो खट्टे है डोंट ईच देम विंड फॉल्स इन द लॉन्ग ग्रास यू कुड ट्रिप फाइन एंड यू कैन ट्रिप मीन्स यू कैन स्टम्बल देर लॉन्ग ग्रास इज यू आर वॉकिंग इन एंड यू कैन फॉल ओवर देर सो बी केयरफुल मिस्टर लैम वॉन्स दैट यंग बॉय डेरी फाइन I there I thought this was an empty place. I didn't know there was anybody here. So he becomes, you know, he starts uh, stuttering. Those, uh, बोलने में जैसे रुक रुक के वो बोलते हैं जब when we are scared of something and all. So he says, I thought this was an empty place. मुझे नहीं पता था यहाँ पे कोई बैठा हुआ है. I thought he doesn't know that Mr. Lamb is that uh, owner of this. Uh, fine. So who is Mr. Lamb? Mr. Lamb is an old man who's the owner of the garden. Fine. And how does Derry get into this his garden? By uh, he is entering the garden stealthily without the consent of the owner. That's why he is walking slowly and steadily to get that apple. Fine. So that's all right, Mr. Lamb. I'm here. What are you afraid of, boy? That's all right. See, Mr. Lamb, rather than scolding him, he's okay. He's saying, so what? Why are you afraid? That's all right. It's fine. I thought it was empty, an empty house, Mr. Lamb. So it is, since I am out here in the garden. It is empty until I go back inside. In the meantime, I am out here and likely to stop. A day like this, beautiful day, not a day to be indoors. So, Mr. Lamb, फिर उसको positive करती हैं. So what? कहता I thought the house is empty and the That's why the garden will be empty, and I entered. He says it's okay. Yes, house is empty because I am outside my house, and I am sitting in the garden because it's a very pleasant and beautiful day. Uh, nobody would like to stay indoors in this. Dairy panic. I have got to go. So dairy ko laga. Ab main kya karu? Uske saamne thodi. I will pick up. But he says okay. I need to go. Not on my account, Mr. Lamb says. I don't mind who comes into the garden. The gate is always open. Only you climb the garden wall. सी यहाँ पे हमें आंसर मिला हाउ डेरी एंटर द गार्डन एक्चुअली सो ही एंटर द गार्डन बाय क्लाइंबिंग द गार्डन वॉल क्लियर ही एंटर स्टील दिली विदाउट द कंसेंट ऑफ द ऑनर सो ही सेज आई डो नॉट माइंड हु कम्स इन टू द गार्डन बींग द ऑनर इवन देन द गेट इज ऑलवेज ओपन कहता है इसीलिए मेरे मेरे दरवाजे हमेशा खुले हैं एनी बडी कैन कम यू क्लाइंब द गार्डन वॉल एंड यू कैन कम नो प्रॉब्लम You were watching me. Derry gets angry. See, he gets angry. कि इसने मुझे क्यों देखा when I was jumping upon the wall. I saw you, but the gate is open. All welcome. You are welcome. I sit here. I like sitting. बेटा जो आप अभी read कर रहे हो ना, it has deeper meaning than you think it to be. Fine. You uh, might be thinking that you know, it's such a simple sa conversation. Hai. I like sitting. I'm sitting here, and uh, you entered here. He's saying, "Why you saw me?" He gets angry. It seems to be very simple. Sometimes conversations are very simple. 
when you talk to someone also the person is so rude and we start judging the person ki isko bolne ki aqal nahi hai doesn't have manners and doesn't know how to talk but the reason is something else we never try to perceive the reason so this conversation has deeper meaning you will get to know later fine yahan tak sabko clear hai send me thumbs up jaldi se those who are sitting they are sending the consent shall i continue see i will tell you the meaning of this conversation so i saw you but the gate is open why he is repeating this word a gate is open gate is open again and again he, he means to say that actually the heart his heart is to you can say uh, uh, beg you know for everyone to enter he doesn't have you know that mean attitude that small thinking that nobody can enter my garden so gate is open for everyone so he is very recipient at the other end so he uh, welcomes each and every person in his garden he says all are welcome you are welcome too i sit here i like sitting i would not come to steal anything i had not come to steal anything that is saying matlab main chori karne thodi aaya tha no no the young lads steal scrub the apples you are not so young to so mr lamb agar se usko aur comfortable kar rahe hain He says yes. You have not come to steal. तुम तो वैसे you have just you know छोटे से बच्चे जो होते हैं ना young lads lads means boys young boys steal and scrub the apples. वो तोड़ तोड़ के apples खाते हैं those who are very young you know. तुम तो बड़े बच्चे हो you are not so young. I know that you have just come to my garden. I just wanted to come in into the garden. So actually he is giving he is ashamed you know he is embarrassed. Barry is embarrassed. He what he is thinking about me that I have come here to pick apples. Yes, Mr. Lamb says. So you did. Here we are then. You don't know who I am. A boy, thirteen or so. Fourteen. So Mr. Lamb ne usse baate baato mein na baate karne shuru kar di. He started making him comfortable. You know, this is the thing with the experienced people and good people. He makes uh, you know the the sign of being good person is they make you always comfortable. They always make you comfortable. जहाँ पे आपको discomfort मिला, you are not comfortable, you will run away. So Darry, otherwise he never talks to anyone because of his burnt face, because of his situation. But now he's talking to Mr. Lam because he's making him comfortable here. So Darry says, I just wanted to come in. He says, Okay. Ah, uh, उसे बातों बातों में उसकी age पूछता है. Okay, you look thirteen or so. He says fourteen. But I have got to go now. Goodbye. Because Derry is so introvert personality, he doesn't talk to uh, others much. Mr. Lamb, nothing to be afraid of. Just a garden, just me. But I'm not. I'm not afraid. People are afraid of me. See, this line takes my heart out. A chota sa bacha, fourteen year old. He is giving this statement. वो कहता डरने वो actually Mr. Lamb is making him so comfortable. He is saying that बेटा need not worry, need not get scared. You can enter any time. The gate is always open. But Derry wants to run away after being caught up because he is not at all comfortable. And Mr. Lamb कहते हैं do not get afraid. You know you need not. He says I am not afraid. People are afraid of me. why he is saying so because he has got burnt face and you know he has not received good response from any person in his life people receive him by looking at his burnt face by making him more uh, feeling more miserable by commenting upon his face by you know hum jaan bujh ke dekhenge aise aise karke oh my god with the feeling of disgust and all already that person is suffering जब हम उसको ऐसे देखेंगे दैट पर्सन विल फील मोर बैड अबाउट इट दैट पर्सन नो कि आप किस वे से देख रहे हो सो ही हैज सीन अ लॉट ऑफ थिंग्स इन हिज लाइफ दैट ही हैज मेड अप अ माइंड दैट एवरीबडी यू नो हेट्स मी तो इतना नेगेटिव वो बच्चा हो चुका है उसको लगता है कि वन एवर एनीबडी लुक्स एट माई फेस That person doesn't like me. They are afraid of me. Why should that be? Mr. Lamb says so. Is me? What? Everyone is. It doesn't matter who they are. 
or what they say or how they look how they pretend i know i can see this conversation shows that the dairy is full of full of his heart is full of pain and agony that everyone is afraid of my face it doesn't matter wo kaise hai kaise bolte hai kaise dikhte hai kaise show karte hai jhoot mujhe pata hai i can see that they hate me mr land see what what they think what do they think then mr lamb is you know this is psychological art unless and until you do not pour your heart out you will be ill you will be sick jab tak aap dil ki baat kisi se nahi karoge you will be feeling bad unless and until you do not pour your heart out to someone it will be very difficult for your mental health then so mr lamb is taking the conversation further making that boy feel good there he says you think here is a boy you look at me then you see my face and you think that's bad that's a terrible thing that's the ugliest thing i ever saw you think poor boy but i'm not not poor underneath you are afraid anybody would be i am when i look in the mirror and see it i am afraid of you so this conversation with a stranger very is saying that you also are afraid of my face everybody is afraid of face even i am afraid of my own face jab main mirror dekhta hu apne half burnt face mein dekhta hu i also get scared kyu jhoot bol rahe ho underneath you are feeling something else tum bhi dar rahe ho mera face dekh ke so this is a terrible thing my face is a terrible thing why he is using this word terrible thing for his face because he has received such sarcastic remarks from the people jab bachche chote hote hain na when they are too young to understand anything and you tell them whatever they they take it for granted even teenagers you tell any teenager okay you know you are not looking smart in this dress wo wo sochenge acha i do not look smart somebody comments upon your face somebody comments upon your height whether you are fat or too thin skinny fine any of the physical traits it can be any of the physical traits you know people surrounding us people are not going to be happy when you are fat they will say oh my god you are too fat when you are skinny oh my god itna zyada patla ho gaye aap zyada bhi nahi acche lag rahe ho when you have uh, you know a face full of marks and say oh my god see a doctor so people are going to judge you no matter what it's you who can handle yourself it's only you so this boy because he is too young he is not being channelized properly by anyone at this age students and children they need channelization because bade log jo hote hain they can handle themselves bacche nahi kar sakte hain they are too young to understand this thing their mental health gets affected so he is too much affected by this thing that's why he says that it's a terrible thing the ugliest thing i ever saw ye dialogues us bacche ko bole gaye hain that's why he is thinking that this mr lamb sitting here is also the same jaise baki log mere pe comment karte hain he is also going to comment fine so this is the i'm not going to continue the story any further because time uh, ho chuka hai aapka already but i would you can say ask you all to those who have joined today today we have a beta sixth period of english 2 and i'm not going to uh, stop here ki okay ye chap i'm going to continue this chapter in that period also but most of you think that aaj humne char period laga liye panch laga liye that's enough english you avoid then in the repeated period so please don't do that okay so how many of you will be joining me in the sixth period please respond accordingly i'm noting down this is important we have to continue the chapter anmol sukhmanjo chandan your learning mere upar aisa nahi hai ye kuch bhi vanshika samyak suhani is there gaurav is there rana gurjeet is there what about others web have so those i mean i have been named it's being recorded you know you cannot say 
so it's for your learning it's very beautiful chapter after completing this chapter you will be totally a different person you will learn a new uh, you can say thought of life you know towards such people and zaruri nahi hai ki disability ye dikh rahi hai hame it can be anything you might have faced many things in your life you will be able to relate yourself also okay so we will continue this in another period have a nice day beta